Hey guys, so today we are going to create our first database without any backend language like PHP, Node.js, Django or anything. We just use our Google spreadsheet to connect our HTML form with the spreadsheet. But here are a lot of videos as a tutorial in YouTube. But all the processes are too lengthy and you have to memorize them but in this video I'm 100% sure that you are in master on it because we are going to create a API for this and you can submit any kind of form with within just five minutes so make sure you watch this video till the end and don't forget to subscribe so without wasting time let's create a index.html and basic form that we are going to submit So now we have created our basic form that is required. Now we are going to submit this to our spreadsheet, Google spreadsheet. So let's make all the fields as required first. That makes sense. Okay. So let's use the copy paste method. Okay. Here is the input and also this one. Okay, now we have to give the okay. Now, for simplicity, for the sake of simplicity, let's remove the check make out option. So, now we have to give password. So, let's make this ideas pass also give the name as password password ok also type password label for password also make the id as password everything if same then the code is give the best optimum output so give this id email email type email ok and name also email so 
so that's it now let's check it again okay there is nothing any not kind of any issue but we already make all the fields as required yeah so now let's get our action so the basic idea of submitting any form is under the action tag so let's make this action as blank and method we need the method method as post because we don't want any email address or password to be passed through address bar so let's create our api so for this just go to sheet db documentation now simply select account let's i am selecting this account so was stage host okay now also give the access and now the api is empty so first of all go to the account now go to your google spreadsheet sign in there okay network issue okay yeah they got to no not now let's create a blank sheet name this as okay network issue let's reload this page so yeah page is ready now let's rename this as database make sure you follow all the steps okay now go to share yeah now change to anyone with link copy link done so yeah now the database spreadsheet is can be shared to anyone this is the first step to create a api so again back to sheet db um, now before creating a new api let me first go to the billing system and this is the paid version of this is not the paid version this is free plan but you get two spreadsheet api absolutely free so as a beginner you can continue with this so first create a new api so for this you just need the link that you have copied right now and now create api yes as there is no column name so it will ask for a column name so first of all give email okay now uh, important step is please make sure that what the name you give here also the name is match should be here the name should be match here email and password so we are going as follows and add column names so yeah we have did it so our api is ready and now simply click here and your api is copied to clipboard and simply just go to form action and paste the link here so yeah you have did it successfully and now if you are going to submit any kind of email and password you successfully did that so if you go to your spreadsheet you can check that your database is created successfully and you get your email and password accurate in accurate way so hope you understand today's video and now from now you can also create database like this in just 5 minutes
please make sure you subscribe this channel and also don't forget to share this video with your friends so that they can also create this kind of backend like you and that's it that's all for today thanks for watching